are underway for the eclipse that's going to be passing through Utah come October. It's an annular eclipse where the moon will pass directly in front of the sun. And that type of eclipse always brings in big crowds. New specialist Alex Cabrero visited one small town just over the Utah line in Nevada where all the lodging is already booked. If you've ever been to Baker, Nevada, just across the Utah state line, then you know there aren't a lot of people who live out that way. On a good day, about 100. Liz Woolsey is yeah, one of them. She owns a couple of businesses out there. But I am the CEO, the chief enthusiasm officer. <laughs> It's that kind like of enthusiastic it. attitude that's going to help in a couple of months when Baker just might feel like a big city. Yeah, we are going to be uh, welcoming people probably from all over the world. You see, there are lots of people who travel for the perfect spot to view a big time eclipse. And the annular eclipse this October is going to pass right over Baker. Uh, we have been booked out for over a year. All the lodging in Baker is full. This is what an annular eclipse looks like as the moon passes in front of the sun, leading to a ring of fire when the moon is directly between Earth and the sun. Oh, oh my gosh, I can see it. It's similar to the eclipse many people came to see in Canaraville in southern Utah back in 2012. Woolsey is planning a three-day party for this eclipse with music, dancing, author readings, and lots of food and fun. Oh, this is a festival in the making, right? She remembers seeing the total eclipse in 2017, where the sky goes completely dark and says it's a moment everyone should see and feel at least once. Oh, yeah, and that, that just is still right here. It, is, it was the most amazing experience. And even though this is a ring of fire, the, the moon will completely block the sun, but it'll be a little ring of fire. That, that sun will come around, but that still is going to be just fabulous. So fabulous, it's going to make little old Baker a pretty big deal. Oh, we're ready for anything. <laughs> we're ready for anything. Now, the middle of the eclipse path is also going to go through Meadow, Marysvale, Boulder, and Bluff on its way through Utah. The date, October 14th. That is a Saturday, and it will be happening in the morning. If you do go out to see the eclipse, just make sure you have these eclipse-type sunglasses or something similar to these so you don't do any damage to your eyes. Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News. Oh.